of car break-ins has been reported in Spartanburg County. 7 News' Alessandra Young has the latest details on the investigation. The Spartanburg Police Department says a string of car break-ins happened Thursday night into early Friday morning, and they believe one group is responsible. Lock up your cars and check your surroundings. Adriana Martinez says she woke up Friday morning to find her car was broken into. I came out at about 7.30 this morning. There was about 10 people standing outside that all their cars had been broken into as well. But they did take the cash out of my middle console, but they left everything else. Police say she's one of many victims. We're told six cars were broken into at the Lively Apartments and two at Bon Haven. We believe that there were three people involved and the people appear to be three male juveniles. Major Art Littlejohn says people are locking their doors and taking their valuables inside. What we did notice is in each case the passenger side window was broken and immediately we believe that they were going straight directly to the glove box. He says the thieves were looking for handguns. In these cases, no weapons were taken. They were searched for. The passenger side windows were broken out and all of them, the glove box, were left open. He says these could be connected to the ones that happened at Drayton Mills earlier in the week. In those cases, the sheriff's office says majority had windows smashed, with the rear passenger side busted out. It happened within a couple of days in the same area of town. And so therefore, uh, we believe that all three are, are connected. They're looking to identify the group they believe is responsible. In the meantime, he says you should park in well-lit areas. Continue to lock your doors. Continue to not leave uh, valuables inside, especially not handguns, and then be aware. Major Littlejohn says someone noticed something suspicious and called 911 and played a key role in spooking off the thieves and encourages anyone that sees something off to do the same. In Spartanburg, Alessandra Young, 7 News. And the Drayton Mill apartment officials tell us they are doing all they can on their end and they have surveillance cameras.